Hey everyone, we're live. Hello. <laughs> I'm here with the wonderful Chris from Pretty Little Lions. How are you, Chris? I'm great, thanks. How are you? I'm really good. I'm really excited. I think this is going to be such a, a value-packed, fun session, to be honest. Me too. I'm thrilled. The day is finally here. It's been a long time coming, so I'm very excited. <laughs> um, I can see everyone's in the chat introducing themselves already. But we're, we've got a few people joining, obviously, right now, and there's tons of us here. Let us know in the comments, where are you guys watching from? We can see people from California, from the UK, all over. So let us know in the comments what we've got. In Canada, too. Um, <laughs> uh, Steve from Hastings on the south coast of the nice. UK. I've been there. Sandra from Pittsburgh. PA. Is that there Pennsylvania? No. Where is that? I don't, I'm not American. <laughs> <San Diego. laughs> you're, you're closer than we are. <laughs> I know. <laughs> um, Portsmouth, UK, says Michael. Hey, guys, we've got loads of people showing up still. So we're going to give it a few minutes and then we're going to jump straight in. Pennsylvania. I thought it was Sandra. Thank you. There you go. <laughs> Um, so Chris, do you mind sharing what today is all about? Today is introducing, finally, the stunning wedding and celebration creator. I'm so excited Yay. to finally be able to <laughs> give it to you all. It's amazing. So we're going to go over that, show you what's in the pack, and then I'm going to do a live demo with how to actually use the pack to make a wedding invitation. Amazing. Yeah. So for everyone who's tuned in live right now, if you are into celebrating, or weddings or mm -hmm. birthdays or flowers or yeah. creativity in general and building characters this pack really has everything it is one of the most extensive one of the most beautiful packs i've ever seen in my life and that's with what we do for a living this is all we see all day <laughs> this thing just staggered us when we saw the end result it was like wow you've been super busy chris <laughs> <laughs> well it's taken nine months i could have had a baby in this time <laughs> Yeah. It, it's so it's a kind it's of baby that we brought to life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> totally. Yeah, it's not just for weddings, although we will be doing a wedding invitation today, but you can do, yeah, like any the, any sort of anything to celebrate, it's got something mm -hmm. for you here. <laughs> yeah, the possibilities really are endless. So mm -hmm. let's um, jump right in. If you're able to share your sure. screen, please, Chris. Yeah, I will do that. And it looks like everyone's fine, but if there's a couple of people who have any video or audio issues, um, let us know. Our team are on hand no. in the chat to tell you how to very easily fix that. Okay, so here it is. So far, oops, let's get scrolling. Oh, there's a lovely video that Marco made. So thank you, Marco, if you're listening. <laughs> <laughs> you okay, so yeah. this is the stunning wedding and celebration creator. Mm -hmm. And this is the biggest pack we've ever seen within this kind of genre. It is what we like to call it design, design cuts, a builder kit. Mm -hmm. So you can essentially build whatever you want within this theme. You can create characters, flowers, people, and a whole lot more, which Chris is about to show yes. off right now. So there are t 12 creators total inside this whole package. So there's the bride creator and the groom creator and the little kids creator. It's so cute. You can see here. So you can make little page boys and flower girls. And the archway creator, so you can kind of set a scene and also some geo shapes. But I'll go through them. I'll just, get, this is the brief overview first. Flowers, cakes for every occasion. Is this okay with the scrolling? Yeah, absolutely. And okay, while you've been working on this, mm -hmm. It literally is like 12 products in one. Mm -hmm. It was it extensive. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it <is. laughs> it's, it's, like one, it's like one of our bundles, basically. Yeah. <laughs> My own personal bundle for you. <laughs> and then Kelly, building... Kelly from Illinois says, This is so cool. And oh, Dana says, Wow, so comprehensive. It really is. Yeah. I I think I covered everything. If I haven't, hey, I'll make an update. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're getting a few comments right now just saying, Wow, wait until Chris <laughs> properly gets into this. Yeah, so the brides, I mean, okay, I've got to admit, again, it's not just a wedding thing, but doing the bride dresses or bridal dresses was my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty great. So these are the lovely ladies. So what you do, just like if anybody has any experience with creators, you all you have to do is click on layers to pick different options. You don't have to draw anything or do anything. You just click on and off visibility in Photoshop and you can create whatever you want. 
So just step by step, you build your lady. And those are, there's um, directions as well. And she comes in six skin tones. And then there's 24 different bridal gowns. And each one actually has some, um, if you look in them, I'll show you when we actually do the invite. They, um, each one might have some other options as well to change them up a little bit too. I can't believe you made 24. I didn't know I there know. were 24 variants of I, know, I didn't know either. <laughs> <laughs> Just kept going. <laughs> yeah. So Stunning though. It was really fun. So lots and lots of detail. It's my middle name apparently. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, if we pause for a second, you, you guys can see we have so much lace on some of yeah. these and just these fine detailing on the back and arms and so on. Mm -hmm. So this girl, this dress actually comes in, you can either have the sparkly lace or white lace. Mm -hmm. There's options like that. So you can create a invitations, of course. And this is a bit of an overview, guys. So I can mm -hmm. see in the comments, some people want to see close-ups. We're going oh, to be okay. able to show close-ups yes. when we do the live tutorial today. So we're going to show you guys how to actually make stuff using this pack and we can really mm -hmm. zoom in. Exactly. Yeah. So lots, lots of different ladies. Do you want me to just go through these all? Like, I don't know, Yeah, this is great just to take it okay, all in, to be honest. Yeah. I feel like very few people have actually... Um, you know, seen how in depth this is. We did oh, one. Okay. We did one private live hangout, didn't we? Yes. Where we, we showed a bit of a teaser, and people were blown away. Then, so mm -hmm. to be able to reveal it all today. Yeah. So it's really great. You can make make yourself. <laughs> well, I'm not sure if anybody really looks like this, but <laughs> <laughs> your your character self, right? <laughs> I love the variety. Honestly, the poses. Okay the various skin tones and hair. I, I feel like it captures a, a lot of people. Oh, good. Well, you'll see this lady looks like she's doing the walk like an Egyptian dance kind of thing here. It makes sense when you put the couples together. <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah, lots of variety. And this dress actually um, comes with sleeves or no sleeves. And, you know, you can do, do a few different variations like that, which is nice. Uh, it's getting a lot of love in the comments. Oh, good. <laughs> Jackie says, this is beautiful. And Charlene says, this is wild. Kudos to all the hard work it took to make each <laughs> item. I mean, literally, it's been nine full months. Yeah. Just, just outdone herself. Yeah. So you can make your own wedding planner book. So you're in our cards. Thank you cards. Any sort of stationery, really. So you'll see that the flowers are are actually all watercolor flowers and the ladies were designed in Procreate. So it was a fun and interesting thing to combine the two to make them look like they belong together. And I think it worked. That was oh, good. <laughs> definitely worked. Yeah. Sorry, while I'm scrolling, I'm not sure what to talk to you about. <laughs> I, <clears throat> I'm just taking it in, to be honest. And Chris, you know, I'm uh, I'm getting married next year, so I I'm know. I'm already deep in wedding fever, and this pack is so perfect. I'm, <laughs> I'm in the process of trying to design some of our invites, and I think this might oh, be getting nice. used. Absolutely. Be, oh, I should have made a Tom one. <laughs> Tom and Maxine specifically. Maybe I'll do that. Uh, I don't know if you've got a skin tone as pale as me right now. <laughs> Send me a picture and I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> That's very kind. Yeah, just the detailing is incredible. Yeah. And for everyone watching, I know everyone's kind of taking it in right now. Mm -hmm. I think we're still on the first section. We are, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think we've gotten through the wedding dresses now. Okay, so mm -hmm. there's 30 hairstyles, <laughs> and they come in five hair colors. Amazing. So you should be able to pick a do that works for you. You can see that. Yeah, drawing hair takes a while. <laughs> <laughs> I think the lace takes a while. Hair is hard. Okay, so here you can see she has some examples of how some couples could go together. 
Yeah, that pose is starting to make more sense now. Yes, right. <laughs> <laughs> that looks weird by itself. <laughs> Amazing though. So you can use it to make some your um, wedding registry and stuff like that. Oh uh, yeah, like a custom yeah. website. Yeah. Do you wish that you had this when you got married, Chris? Yes, <laughs> I do, because seriously, I actually made my own wedding invitations, but I didn't, I did made them all by hand, like all this paper art stuff. Oh, mm -hmm. I, I regret doing that. <laughs> it's like a long time. This would have been easier. <laughs> Oh, so now we're, we're getting to the grooms now. Here's the lovely distinguished gentleman here, yes. <laughs> so, of course, they all come in different skin tones as well. And they have, I can't even tell you how many outfits they have because it's all, you, you know, mix and match, build your own, right? Mm -hmm. So there's lots of colors available for the accessories and um, two different jacket styles, two different pants styles. Um, I love and, it. There's, and, there's yeah. so many options. Yeah, and you can do rolled cuffs or or a classic white shirt, all those sorts of things. So they that's kind of whatever you design with their outfits. And if we pause there for a second, Chris, sure. um, mm -hmm. let us know in the comments if you appreciate the little duckies on the mm -hmm. guy's underwear, because that's one of my yeah. favorite touches. <laughs> <laughs> uh, to make them all so tight, because you have to, of course, put the clothes over top, right? <laughs> <laughs> Well, if you're going to get ducky underwear, it's oh, got to be yeah, form-fitted. Sure. I think that's, <laughs> that's the rule. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> of course, they have all their hairstyles. There's 27. And I know someone said man bun before. And I'm like, oh, shoot, did not do a man bun. Maybe next time. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's a pretty good variety there, though. And facial hair, of course. Mm -hmm. Do that, too. And the little kids. We got the cute kids. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. So the girls, the girls have mix and match. You can kind of build your own outfit here too. I'll show you when I do the invitation. I'll put her a little girl on as well. And get the idea. The boys are similar to the men with how you build their outfits. And they have a stylish young gent there. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Quite. So, again, so you can put something together as well. <laughs> Jackie says, if uh, only it was that easy to pick out a groom. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so I just, I, this, I love this bit so much because it really just helps you frame everything else you're making. Yeah. So this is the archway creator. So there's a circle and a rectangle or square arch. And also has the hanging pendants, which I call geo shapes. I'm not sure if that's the name, but that's mm -hmm. what I'm calling them. <laughs> <laughs> so you can build this um, here. I'll bring it here. So you can pick what color um, of the wood you want and then the different colors of the fabrics. And you can also place the flowers. You don't have to have all three. You can have a different variation or turn each section off right left and top so you can make it as full or plain as you want and the shapes there's already pre-made um, flowers in them or you can use with the DIY with well I have all the individual flowers as well so you can actually make one up yourself I mean what Something staggers like me is what you're showing on screen right now that would normally mm -hmm. be a product in itself yeah. <laughs> you know some incredible yeah. flowers and and some great variations there mm -hmm. and that's only one part of one part of this yeah. wider product it really <laughs> is just so extensive i put in some of the lace patterns for you too just if you wanted them for backgrounds and stuff like that just so that they kind of go together so amazing so this is the bouquet creator and it's pretty cool you can make a bouquet just by turning on enough layers it has all the flowers in it so you can design whatever bouquet you want and you've got the different ribbons with different colors yeah. and oh yeah. the, ta the tags i hadn't seen mm -hmm. those before yeah so you can That's put amazing. on your little tag and create your stems that we want or you can do it without stems too if you just wanted a a cluster so you just it's all um done in quadrants and layers so you have 
four layers, I believe. I haven't looked at it for a minute. <laughs> four <laughs> layers. And then sections. So it's like, you know, um, the right side, the right center, left center, left. And you go and just pick whatever flower you want for each section. Amazing. Create something new every time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one's really fun. Yeah, it's one of my I, I love favorite. this part. I know he'll be like, it's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's one of my favorites too. <laughs> So you can create lots of things. So of course the bouquet is for any celebration, not just weddings. Matt's watching live, by the way. I know. Hi, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> He's saying you're the best to work with. And I'll agree, but, um, He's Jane... the best to work with. I love working <laughs> oh, with Oh, stop. Him. No, you're the best to work with. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> you're pretty great too, Doc. <laughs> <laughs> so here yeah, are all the... <laughs> All the individual flowers, so you can have these to play with to make whatever you want. And all the leaves. I actually have my YouTube channel, I'm populating it with all the videos on, I made on how I painted all that actually. Mm -hmm. So that's good. Yeah, for anyone know. who wants an insight, we can link that exactly. up later. Um, watch. I, I know people like watching your pro process yes. of this. <laughs> And now on to the cakes. There's more people. There's more. There's more. <laughs> we might be here a while. <laughs> <laughs> so there, these are the fancy cakes. So this would probably be more for weddings or anniversaries or um, adult celebrations or mm -hmm. yeah, sort of more for grown-ups. So you can just pick your tiers. Um, there's all different tiers. And then you decorate them with different acing there's oh my god and i mean so this many. this is not just weddings this works for birthdays yeah. just as exactly. easily birthdays, and so, yeah. you can get one tier if you like and yeah yeah oh yeah birthdays anniversaries whatever you want so you just decorate with the icing and the um oh what am i trying to say the cake stand it, yeah <laughs> and <laughs> all the piping and flowers and you can also do toppers like uh the numbers or there's initials and a couple words as well. Amazing. So you can make all sorts of cakes. So there's pre-made oh. stuff, and then of course you can put your own flowers and details on it as well. I'm kind of regretting the fact that I have a job because I just <laughs> want to sit at home and play with this now. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Okay. And then you have more of a kids themed one. Oh, this is awesome. So this is great for kids' birthdays and whatnot. And so this is all about treats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Same principle, you pick your tiers and decorate with different um, icings and whatnot. And they have lots of goodies and toppers as well for kids. This looks like every kid's dream. Mm, looks like my There's dream. There's just some such a Willy Wonka <laughs> level cakery <laughs> going on. <laughs> That's awesome. And then you have all the individual treats that you can, again, put do what you want with. Amazing. And then more of a baby theme. So this is great for baptism, christenings, baby dedications, baby oh. birthdays, baby, any, yeah. or welcome to the world, baby. <laughs> let's, um, let's show some love if we could pause there for a second, Chris. Let's show some love for the miniature pram on top of that cake. <laughs> Look at that thing. That's the most adorable thing in the world. <laughs> Thank you. And it's completely customizable. We've got people asking about the colors and so on. Yes. Yes, it is. There you go, Vicky. Yes. There are, are these colors, um, these sets. So you, you pick the um, color of icing. So mm -hmm. I have these colors set out. And then, of course, um, in Photoshop, you can change them, tweak them a little bit as well. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Ah. I'm actually starting to feel really staggered at the value this is available for, which we're going to get to a little bit later after the tutorial. But um, seeing again how much is in this, it is ludicrous value. Yeah. Oh, look at that birthday. Yeah. Yeah, so it's perfect for birthday cards, birthday yes. invitations, so any kind of celebration. Exactly. So now we're on to balloons. So that covers a lot of different celebrations as well. Like my little bear, he's very cute. 
<laughs> so the balloons, um, you can get them in transparent or solid colors, and then you can add different sparkle options, and then you can put the flowers inside, which I think is cool. And then, or there's um, smaller balloons as well if you don't, if you wanted to go more masculine. I hope you don't like flowers. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, everyone likes flowers. Oh, well, I was going to say, we were to buy this pack, we didn't like flowers as well. It's <laughs> a, a lot of flowers in it. <laughs> and then um, you can decorate the strings and add some accessories and weights and things like that. Jill says, This is amazing. <laughs> I feel like, just honestly, I want to see where people's imagination and creativity can take this because yeah. I think you could create an entire world. I know. At I know. Any event or celebration, this is not just here's a standalone balloon or here's a flower that you can add mm -hmm. to a design. You can build everything from scratch using this pack and just build an, a universe of celebrations. Totally. Oh, I would love to see people's work. I love to see it in action. So always send me that stuff, guys. I'd love to see it. <laughs> yeah, we can't wait to see what you guys build. Yeah. So you can do baby books and stuff like that. That'd be cute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, and bunting. The bunting and presents. Okay. So the bunting comes in three to 12 letters or um, so are different flags. So you can have mm -hmm. up to 12 letters and you just turn on and off the letters to create whatever saying you want and you can change the flag colors and decorations to make Amazing. all very customizable. I don't know anyone that doesn't love bunting. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> love a good bunting. And then the presents, there's four different shapes and uh, different colors of backgrounds. And then you can do overlays to make um, different patterns and toppers and bows and ribbons. Oh, and th this is where the pack really comes into its own, I think, because I don't want anyone to see this pack and think, well, I'm not really in the wedding space. Mm -hmm. So it's not for me because mm -hmm. even if you ignored all the wedding stuff, this is better value than any pack you're gonna find that deals with florals or yeah. gifts or presents or character creators, like anything like that. Mm -hmm. I, I would get it alone just for this piece because I could yeah. use this anytime I was doing something <laughs> gift related on my website or social media or, or for yeah. a printout or something. Absolutely. Oh yeah. Well, there's 60, what is there, 62 flowers, just in the watercolor flowers in this pack. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so. Just for that, you can create all sorts of cute stuff. That. Yeah, that's adorable. And then I did a table so that we can put things on, <laughs> <laughs> like presents and cakes, and why not some champagne? So this is very good for all that stuff. And then you can, uh, there's different options for the tables, and then you can also put a table cloth on it and decorate that as well. Amazing. And lastly is the baby. <laughs> so this is great for toddlers and babies. And um, again, baptism, baptisms and christenings and sorts of things, celebrations as well. So you can create your baby and your high chair and decorate it. And Super cute. boy to girl or a girl from the hairstyles and hair decorations. <laughs> yeah. and that is the end and it comes with some directions too <laughs> but it's, it's really like, self-explanatory it's, it's like you thought of everything <laughs> oh thanks yeah so that is so amazing wow yeah chris thank you so much for that overview let's show some love in the comments everyone let us know what you think of the pack so far and in just a moment we're going to actually show you how to work with it to create an amazing yeah invitation so um elise says this is adorable i would <laughs> to agree <laughs> it really is um chris massive respect for how much time oh. and effort and just work you put into this thing it's yeah i'm in awe yeah. thanks <laughs> sandra, sandra says i've already purchased it uh, oh. michael says I, I didn't even look at the wedding creator um i watched it because it was a design cuts thing but this is incredible <laughs> can't believe it's on sale <laughs> love, 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 Jill says. Um, that's a ton of work, and I love it. Kimberly says, Tamara oh, says, love you. it. Just wonderful, <laughs> says Mia. Best purchase I've ever made, Deborah oh, says. Wow. <laughs> um, and thank you, Jody as well. Pet forward, Pat, as well. We're so glad that you guys love it. Um, mm -hmm. Chris, are you ready to show how to use I this? Am. Yes. 
Steve says, unbelievable in giant oh. letters. <laughs> and Jackie just bought it as well. Thank you, Jackie, for grabbing Thanks, it. Guys. Okay, so let's make this today. I'm going to bump up the colors because uh, I'm not sure if you can see the text as well. We, but... we, we can, we can, yeah. Okay, you can. Okay, okay, great. Awesome. So let's make that. So first of all, I'm going to start with the template. And it's... Um, it's five and a quarter inches by seven and a quarter, if anybody is wondering. <laughs> I love the here's, here's one I made earlier. Uh, yes. And that, now we're going blank canvas. We're going blank canvas. But I had to make it earlier, so I wasn't trying to think on the spot of what I wanted to do. <laughs> <laughs> no, it looks stunning. Okay, so let us know in the comments who is ready to learn how to make a wedding invite. We're going to go through the whole process right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's start with our lady. because. So I like to start, I'm gonna start with this gal here. Open her up. Okay, so this is how it all starts. So I'm, I'll am i take off the dress so you can see. Oops, now she's naked. Well, hmm. kind of. <laughs> this is how easy it is though, guys. This is not yeah. like horribly complex to use. No. It is so intuitive. It's just turning layers on and off. Exactly. That? So you look here, I'm going to go to her body first and I'm going to choose her skin type. I'm going to go for skin type three just to go sort of middle of the road here. You can look at her lips and she actually has, you can change her lip color a little darker or lighter. I'm going to keep it mid. You can also, in this one, you can actually actually just close lips as well if you don't want her smiling, a little pouty look. <laughs> You know, I've never seen a pack like this, by the way, Chris. Yeah, I, I think that the nearest yeah. thing I've seen is there's two or three characters that you can't customize. Yeah. So you either have to use them as they are or, or not at all. Mm -hmm. This has everything by comparison. Oh my gosh, thanks. Okay, so she's got blue, green, or brown eyes. And let's do green, you know what, let's do brown today. And <laughs> you can also change her um, eyebrow colors so you can make that darker as well for blondes or brunettes. And I'll do her hairstyle. So she's got all these options here, you can see. So that's how that goes. I think I'll do this one. And so if you open up all of the hairstyles, you'll have the colors in there as well. Oh, that's I love cool. it. I love as well that you've got the base um, because I've got a few female friends who are bored. Yeah, so they're covered well, as well. I think she looks really fantastic like that. Yeah, <laughs> a she very looks nice shaped head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we can do that color. I think. Well, that's what we did before. And then you can change her jewelry as well. Of course, she's got her wedding ring there. <laughs> you can see it. I actually took a picture of a diamond. It's not a real diamond, but that's just a picture of a diamond. <laughs> Nice sparkle, sparkle. Bracelet. Yes, and then you thank, can change. Thank you, Claire, for for grabbing it as well. We appreciate it. Oh, thank you. Enjoy, have fun. Yes, and her earrings. Um, depending on the hairstyle, you might need to turn on or off one of her earrings because the hair will come over. So that is in there as well. So it won't will be a floating earring over top. <laughs> or she can have stud earrings and necklaces as well. So I think we'll just go with that. That looks good. And we can give her something in her hair. That's not going to work. Just that one. Oh, that one looks good. Oh, they're so stunning, the hair pieces. And you can change the size of them too. Like, don't be afraid to, you know, do that. Yeah, there's lots of all these different ones you can do. Advanced tiaras. Okay, so then should pick her dress. And we're gonna go with one of my favorites, I think. So uh, let's see, I can show you in here for this example, this one in particular, if you open up the dresses, you can see that this one has a couple of options. So you can give her some more sparkly leaves, or sleeves, sorry, or no <laughs> sleeves. You can have it like that. Just for a change, give her some more sparkles on the bottom. 
Yeah. Serene um, just joined us. Don't worry, Serene. We're just getting started with the tutorial portion yes. of this live session. So you're, you're right on time. So this one I'm going to use and I'm going to open it up and I can change the take off the bands, make them sparkly bands. I think I'll do that. All right. We're almost done with this lady. Give her a bouquet. And so there's 10 um, pre-made bouquets. And again, you can make your own if the one doesn't suit you or what your style is. I think I'll go with this. It's one of my favorites. And there, she's done. <laughs> Amazing. She's and that was, that was so quick and easy. Yeah. And I was showing you stuff too. Like, well, you know, you just go and discover and then you. Yeah. I, I love it. And I echo what some of the people in the comments are saying, because <laughs> I'm not the best artist, but I love mm -hmm. creating. So there's yeah. no way I could draw this myself, but I love being able to customize it and play with it exactly. and create. It's fun, it's like dress up dolls. So I'm gonna turn off the background layer and my texture layer and just save it as a PNG. And I'm gonna save it in my demo. There. And Tamara um, just bought it as well. Thank you, Tamara. Thank you, Tamara. Appreciate it. Okay, so she's done. Actually, I'm not going to save that because it's my PSD file. <laughs> <laughs> and then let's go make our man. So if you see the brides, they're listed 1A, 1B, 1C. So they all fit with that groom. Uh, but they uh, actually can mix and match too. But um, some of them, the ones that are uh, profile ones that with the hands, they actually do kind of match up. Yeah. Better than others. So this guy goes with this curl. All right. So he was looking rather pasty. <laughs> so <laughs> let's give him a little. little Nothing glow wrong here. with that. <laughs> <laughs> <That's right>. <laughs> <laughs> let's give him a glow. And so he, same thing, has, and he actually has more eyebrow colors. Um, we felt it was important to give him some more options. Actually, I'm gonna give him lighter brown and we'll give him blue eyes. Should we have facial hair, do you think? Let's see, maybe a little scruff. Yeah, why not? Why not, let's do it. He, he's hung over from the stack. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> Hairstyles, um, I, I like this one. There you go. Let's make him a blonde surfer, dude. <laughs> <laughs> He's got his wedding ring. He has gold or silver wedding ring, just in case you wanted to pick. <laughs> Is your husband <laughs> blonde or brunette, Chris? Oh, he has dark hair. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, I thought so. Yeah. yeah, I'm not making my husband this time. <laughs> <laughs> I usually do, but I'll switch it off. <laughs> then he's got shoes and socks. Um, so depending on the color of pants, you might want to change the sock color. I think we'll leave it black for today. I'm genuinely curious if anyone mm -hmm. is going to make a, a wedding invite and the groom's going to be in the ducky underwear. <laughs> <laughs> so it'll be like a glorious bride and then <laughs> an unshaven groom in his duck underwear. That's right. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, we'll be do like a, a certain kind of couple would do that. That's right. Totally. <laughs> I'm going to go classic today, I think, and do a regular text. So here you can go in the white shirt and you can select. So you have the rolled up sleeves or you can do, oh, Chippendales. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't mean for that to happen. <laughs> All right, long sleeves. <laughs> give them some cufflinks. So there's pleats on the shirt too, if you can, here, I'll zoom in so you can see it here. So you can do the... Um, turn on and off the pleats if you like that. And then the buttons, you can also choose between silver, white, or black buttons. I'll keep them like this. Amazing. So, again, it's just the level of detail. Yeah. I, I don't think I've ever seen such a level of detail on any kind of pack like this. <laughs> Give them suspenders. Why not? <laughs> Although we won't see them today because we're going to do a jacket, I think. Mm -hmm. So, oops. So you have two different jacket styles here. So I can open or closed. We'll go classic with closed, keep it black too. And then 
there's the pocket squares and you have all the different colored pocket squares as well. So I can make it different. I'll just go Amazing. classic white. Guys, and, it's oh, looking very it's charming fine. indeed now. It's like you James know. Bond staring out at us. <laughs> I'll give my cover one. And we'll do bow tie. Oops, not him. And I'll make it black. Classic. I like a yep. classic tax. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, he looks very distinguished, I think. Very dapper. <laughs> All right, turn off my texture and background and save them as a PNG. Do you want me to do the, the little girl too? I had her in there, but I'm just conscious um, of time as well. Yeah, let's maybe jump into the, uh, yeah. the template. If, Sounds good. If we could. But yeah, that's a really good overview of just how much you can customize. Yeah. Oh, I should probably do the archway first. So actually, yeah, sure. Get that as the background, and then we'll get into it. So I'm going to do the square one. And Let us know in the comments, everyone, if this is helpful so far. If you're mm -hmm. anything like me, whenever I watch these demonstrations, I just get really mesmerized and lost. <laughs> I, kind of, I forget I'm watching live. I feel like I'm watching my favorite TV show or something. <laughs> So if you have black or white, I'm going to do white this time for the wood surround. My, Michael says he has to leave his house, but he's going to switch <laughs> to his phone because he doesn't want to miss out at all. <laughs> Sweet. So you can choose um, all these different colors of fabric swags, but I'm going to go with white today. And you can do, like I said before, you can turn on and off the leaves behind on each section. Oh, and um, there's 12 group or 10 groupings of flowers. So I'm gonna choose the one that corresponds with the flowers that she had. And you can turn on and off those as well. And I'm just gonna leave the right side blank just to show that there's a difference. And the chandelier can be moved as well. And I know for this picture, I've already made this decision that I'm gonna actually have to have it over here a little bit more. Mm -hmm. And there. There's the arch. Nice and simple. Nice and simple. And save it as a PNG. Oh, I just realized I think I saved the other one in the Grim section. It's okay. I'll go back and get it. Okay. Saving that. All right. That's the done. Wow, it's quick. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm going to put make this this blue color that I've used lots of times before I bring things in. Then I'm gonna go back and get all my people. Although I'm just gonna double check that I didn't accidentally put him in here. I did, yeah. Thought he was in there. He's hiding. He is. And then I'll go on the demo. All right. Change her size. All right. Move that to the back. And let's see. Yeah, so it's pretty pretty intuitive and straightforward creating these little guys, I think. Yeah, this is not, you know, advanced Photoshop no. techniques oh, here. No. This is drag and drop, turning on yeah. and off layers. Like anyone can use it, whether you're experienced or you're a beginner. Exactly. Super easy to use. All right. I was going to say, I think if I use this for our wedding invites, I'm going to have to really play with the height difference. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I, like know. A giant next I know, right? to my fiance. I know. I'm a lot shorter than Matt too. I but I made these people a lot a lot more equal <laughs> <and nice. laughs> Well, I did also give the girls heels and uh make the dresses quite believable. That is true. Well. Yeah. I know. Now Matt's what is he? Six he's six uh he's almost six three and I'm five five, so yeah, there's a bit of a difference. <laughs> That's pretty much the same as uh, my fiance and I. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So now what am I doing? I have to think. Um, actually, I'll do the background. That's what I was going to do. Mm -hmm. I'll show you also the patterns. Um, I'll bring those in. And 
Oh, where am I now? There we go. To think. There's just so much in there. It's like, <laughs> what part do I want to dive into next? Exactly. Okay, so I'm going to bring a pattern into Photoshop. And you can't see it very well right now, but I'm going to define it as a pattern. So it's in there. Yeah, you can just make out a bit of the detail. Is that a lace pattern? Yes. So, and then I'm going to bring it in here and go layer, fill layer, pattern. And I'll select, oops, yeah, select that one. And scale it way down. You can't quite see it yet, but I'll change that. Mm, yeah, maybe like 15. Okay, and then I'm going to rasterize it so that I can put an overlay, color overlay on it. Right, now we can see it a bit. Mm -hmm. You know what? I'm going to double it there. Now you can really see it. <laughs> oh, yeah, cool. Okay, so then I'm going to go and get a rectangle. Even that's just really nice, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm going to fill it with the same blue color. I think. There we go. Yep. Okay. I'm going to get these rid of these guides just so we have a background. Actually, I'm going to bring that in a little bit more too. Somewhere. So it's just a really subtle but elegant yeah, border. Border. And then I'm going to duplicate that rectangle and go back and change it to give it a. Not that. <laughs> Give it a stroke. And it will be, let's say, four, six. Yeah, maybe six. Maybe and what six. I love is you don't need to mess around with super complex compositions here because no. the illustrations do the talking for you. Exactly. I think that they're so strong that you can just work within their color palette, position things with a bit of balance, and then you're good to go. Yeah. Exactly. So I just brought in a gold textures to make that outline. Oh, gold nice. Gold and then you and then you clipped it. Then I clipped, yeah, clipping mask over just that rectangle border I made. Yeah. Okay. So let's probably should put some text in here. And make it white. Bring back my guides. And I'm gonna use I'm gonna use a lore. Oops. That's spelling for me. Just Laura and ah, come on now. There we go. The oops, I'm trying to make it this. Please join us for the wedding. Oh, you got to do. Oh. Lovely. What font did we go with there? That was Laura. I think mm -hmm. it's a free font, actually, if I remember correctly. Oh, perfect. Yeah. And then I'm going to do, um, I like this uh, Angelina font. I think it's actually free, too, I think. Wait. Where is it? Ah, Angelina script. To look it up to see if that's if I'm telling the truth that it's free. <laughs> I think it might be. And then let's call um, Alex and Michael says, um, I already feel like a wedding brand master from watching Chris in action. <laughs> You're so sweet. I think this and is too big, so I'm gonna change that. Let's bring it down a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna use um, this script has glyphs. So I'm going to change that, make it something prettier, a little tail. Where's the one that's on the left-hand side? Come on. There's that one. Is that the one I want? That, oh, that's cool. That, that looks cool. And then this. This is a nice font. Yeah, it's pretty, isn't it? Let's see if we can get a similar H. Oh, not big enough. Oh, I don't have the H that is quite the same. Exaggerated. That's okay. Yeah, I, I see there what you're go. going for there. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. 
Well, we go. we've gone swishy. It's good enough. It's yeah. good enough. I would make them more even normally, but you know what? Today we won't worry about it. <laughs> we will carry on. All right. And then, of course, let's put some details in here. Go back to Laura's script and it keeps doing this to me. Get all caps. I think we had it about 18. Um, Saturday. Oh, it's way too big. I don't know what date anyone's getting married, but <laughs> it's right. let's make it out. We're in fictional <laughs> wedding land. That's three thirty is a great time to get married, I think. <laughs> we'll make this smaller. There. Amazing. Oh, can I be such a pain, Chris? Yeah. Sat you Saturday has a oh. typo. I'm, I'm, I'm known for this in our office. Nope, <laughs> I do this all the time. I promise. Okay, I'm not the best speller, but I do know how to spell. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> not the best typer. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. All right. And then let's say it's at making things up. Lord house. I'm sure that sounds fancy, right? Mm -hmm. All right, and then if we're really being picky, I'm sure we space that all much better. But yeah, anyway, that is that is about it to make a wedding invitation, unless you have more details. And That's then so cool. I can put it on a mock-up for you if you want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know anywhere that provides high-quality mock-ups, Chris. <laughs> I don't know where. <laughs> So confusing. That's really stunning. Um, I can see some questions coming in actually. Mm -hmm. So, are you good if we jump into Q some Q and A um, yeah. in a moment? That was amazing, though. We're we're bringing you back in the room. Video. Yeah. How do I? That's no, okay. I will. Um, I'll close it. Okay. For you. I just got pushed X, and I don't want to close there the video. <laughs> <laughs> um, everyone watching live, let us know what you think. Having seen the pack up close and personal and just the level of detail and the level of customization and creativity inside. We'd love to get your feedback, but I'm blown away. Honestly, every time you show me this pack, it's like, <laughs> wow. <laughs> do you feel like quite proud of it? I do. Oh, big sense of accomplishment. I don't know if I've yeah. ever worked on a project that long. That was really, you know, and to try to keep it consistent the whole way through. So I'm, I'm proud of myself. <laughs> you should be. It's incredible. Yeah. Oh, no, you, you and Matt yeah. have worked so, so well together and oh, yeah, oh. It's stunning. Now he's a dream to work with, yeah. But yeah, so I think cool. um, we love your work and we know our, our community love your work. But I think this is hands down just the most amazing thing you've ever made. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> oh, thank you for the kind words, guys, in the comments. Oh, Tammy says, pretty amazing. Okay. Jackie is blown away. Thanks, Michelle, Jackie. with the emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much, guys. So we're going to jump into some Q&A now. Um, if you haven't noticed, there is a lovely shiny green button below this video. And if you haven't yet, click through. It will open up the page where you can get this pack. And it is 50% off for the first week only, which makes it officially the best value thing I think we've ever sold. So <laughs> everything you've seen, this is 12 packs. This is absolutely everything you need for any kind of creation of celebrations, weddings, birthdays floral arrangements, yeah. everything. It's $19. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure that's the price of a Starbucks coffee these days. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> it's, uh, it's truly amazing. So we're going to answer some questions now um, right. and see if we can help. Um, so Greet says, hi, Chris. Um, do you think it's important to follow or know of wedding stationary trends um, and make fake invites to show on your social media pages or the clients usually know what they want? So I guess Greta's is asking, she's trying to attract clients who would want these yeah. types of designs, um, maybe making some personal projects to attract them. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts on that? Well, I think that's a great idea to do the mock-ups and, and show things that you want to make. Um, I think, again, things that you really love and you want to do, I would show that. And then that should attract the people who like that kind of work, right? I think it's mm -hmm. good to keep on trends, sure. But if something, um, I don't think that's like the most crucial thing to do. If you have an idea and you love it, try it. I mean, why not? You get feedback, ask 
ask you know your audience ask you know what they think and what they want and that's or, uh, as you know having their input is is hugely beneficial so but doing the mock-ups and doing putting it out there on your social media yeah for sure absolutely good idea Definitely. And um, I think it's really, as Chris says, it's what you do with it, isn't it? It's your particular mm -hmm. style and brand that you put into it. And that's why clients want to hire you is to achieve yeah. that certain particular style. So um, we also have someone asking, Faye was asking, what software other than Photoshop can these designs be opened with? She doesn't have Photoshop yet, um, but she really wants to work with it. Okay. Um, Photoshop Elements um, works. And... Um, Affinity Photo, we Affinity think. Photo? Okay. Yeah, someone, someone's saying in the yeah. comments that your other creators work in there. So, okay. Yeah, it's whatever. Fine. Just you just have to have something that works with um, PSDs and then something mm -hmm. that has layers. That's all you need. Yes. So, yeah. So, so, so I'm not familiar quite, with any, quite basic, yeah. um, quite basic software should be able to handle it. Are there PNGs as well, or is it all layer based? Um, all the um, the individual elements like the um the, all the flowers are all png yeah. okay amazing so all the creators are psd <laughs> we had um a couple of people asking about plus size figures and that kind yeah. of thing um is that maybe uh, an update for the future because yeah, i know there's all it's similar to um when we've worked with lisa on her portrait creator for example yeah. often these things have to come with okay. expansion packs because yeah. trying to cover everything yeah. and and of course we have the uh you know the various skin tonality haircuts poses etc exactly. um yeah. but yeah if, if you're open to it chris i think that could be a oh, tremendous update in the future yeah we discussed that at the beginning we decided just to stick with one shape first and then expand from there yeah <laughs> just otherwise i would have taken another nine months <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, sure. any tips or advice for working in the wedding stationery industry Ooh, that's quite like a that is a good quite, question well because i'm not yeah i'm not a wedding invitation expert <laughs> but <laughs> um so i'm not really sure i okay. don't know it just yeah i don't no, know that's that's completely yeah. honest i mean yeah. <laughs> one thing i would say is like any industry mm -hmm. time is money and that's why we're so excited about this pack because this is going to be such a time saver. If you can imagine, I mean, it's taken nine months for Chris to do this. Yeah. So if you if you can imagine the turnaround time and the intensive hours for you to create a completely custom bespoke thing every single time for every single client, I think you'd be blind by the end of it. And so um, in this case, you know, it, it's fantastic that actually you can whip up designs as quickly as she's just demonstrated and give your clients something really, really special. Um, Winston says as well, what about same sex weddings? Yeah, well, the couples can go, they are not, I think there's probably only two that really men and women that actually like the hands fit together kind of thing. But mm -hmm. other than that, you can do whatever you want with it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And we saw that in the production process. Yeah. We were all experimenting with exactly that. Yeah with same-sex couples and so on and it just it works yeah. exactly the same so totally. um do you offer classes in photoshop faces i think you've got a, <laughs> no, you've got a but I, student. oh thank you well i i have a youtube channel and i plan on and um, getting more into doing photoshop tutorials and stuff so Incredible. But i don't yeah, have any I classes yet, but one day i i want to get better at teaching and and be better at that so and be more clear in mm -hmm. all my process so yeah i plan to do that for sure. Awesome. Um, Steve <laughs> says, what size and resolution are the graphics? Size and resolution, oh, they're 300 DPI and they are, oh, I don't know off the top of my head, um, they, they range between 25 to 4,000 pixels, I think. Okay, um, that, that's pretty big. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Especially with I this level of details. Yeah. <laughs> um, so Andrico says, uh, can the cutting marks be turned off? I guess he's talking about some of the bleed oh. and, and so on. So. Oh yes, that was just the template, or just a template I I was just using. Yeah, they're just a layer. You can just turn them off. That's not that template yeah. isn't in the pack though. Yes. Yeah. That's the one I use. Yeah. <laughs> Incredible. And um, Michelle says, "Do you have any suggested fonts um, included? I mean, in terms of specific fonts, but I guess also um, styles. What kind? What kind of style of fonts work with a pack like this?" Oh, well, anything you want, really. <laughs> I'm not sure there's a specific one. Like I said, I really like that Angelina script. 
Mm -hmm. I've just been doing that lately. And Laura, I find really nice. Um, again, that's a free one. Yeah, those are two I really like that's, that I used a lot. Incredible. Yeah, and they, they work Kinfolk. great. Kinfolk was a great one that Matt got me on to. So. Is that the one used in the covers and so on? Yeah. Y really yeah, like that it. works really well. That, that kind of um, all caps serif yeah. used in some of the covers. And that's a design kit. <laughs> 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 um, incredible so do let us know we hope that was really helpful that live demonstration Chris thank you so much it was awesome to see your workflow and see a deeper look with inside the pack um, now is the time to get this pack though guys so let us know in the comments because Chris and I want to personally thank every single person that grabs this and we really want to encourage you to reach out and show us what you make using it that's the favorite part right Chris that's the, oh that's the I'm so excited about yeah that's the best for me <laughs> um so do click and we're, we can put it in the chat as well hopefully uh with the team but if you see the green button below this live stream the stunning wedding and celebration creator if you click on that button it is available for 19 dollars, but not for very long before it jumps up to 39 39 is still ridiculously good value <laughs> One of the best value things in our entire marketplace but at 19 it's an absolute steal so whether you've got a project lined up right now or you don't we highly recommend grabbing it because there's so much in there. I guarantee it will come into use in the next year for you. There's just so many possibilities. Absolutely. Oh, thank you so much, you guys. It's been amazing. <laughs> and it's really worth uh, mentioning as well. Um, again, hopefully the team can pop a link in the chat, but Chris has kindly agreed to actually making her entire store 50% off during this launch week for this new product. So if you've been on the fence about grabbing any of her other incredible charming packs please go and check that out now because there is just a treasure trove of stuff <laughs> in your whole shop as well oh thanks tom yeah absolutely guys Have fun. So, so go scoop it up but we want to see all the cute designs so mm -hmm. chris what is your instagram that might be one of the best places My to instagram? tag you and, and dm you with oh. any oh yeah good idea um it's pretty dot little dot lines pretty yeah. dot little dot lines at instagram we are of course design cuts at instagram so anything that you make using this flag pack please tag us up we want to reshare it we want to post it we want to give you some lovely feedback on it but we can't wait to see what you guys make absolutely i'm so excited me too <laughs> it's finally being shared with the oh, world Chris. <laughs> so good. i'm gonna go celebrate <laughs> yeah. are you gonna have some champagne or something Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> It's a little early still, but maybe tonight. <laughs> Amazing. Well, we hope every single person tuned in enjoyed that. Chris, thank you for giving so generously with your time. Thank you for bringing such an incredible pack to life. We absolutely love it. And we know that everyone here is going to love it as well. Thank you so much. And thank you all for being here. I really appreciate it. Love you guys. <laughs> thanks, Chris. We'll talk to you soon. And thanks again for being amazing. Bye. <laughs> Bye.